Let's get straight podcast. We back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. So today we talking about Jada Pinkett Smith saying something about Will Smith and uh, you know, was they secretly split and all this good stuff. So let's get to it, man. Who raised you? Oh my god. Uh, children are too young to make those type of choices for themselves. You know, that's why they have parents. Oh, eat each other. What? Yo, I yeah, can't I understand it neither. I'm just ahead of it. All right, Jada. Jada Pinkett. Before we get into that, thank y'all. Super chats are still down because YouTube is doing something stupid with our channel. I don't know why. But we're getting handled and hopefully it'll be rectified very soon. If you would like to donate, though, links in the description, cash at PayPal. If not, you don't have any money, you don't want to donate, just share the content with your family. Also, follow us on Twitter and, yeah. Twitter and Facebook. So. Yeah. All right, so let's get into this video, man. And I want to see what she got to say. So let's go. Separately. Jada Pinkett Smith is revealing bombshell details about the state of her marriage to Will Smith. In new interviews, the Girls Trip star says that she has been separated from the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air alum for seven years. In 2016, you and Will decided that you were going to live completely separate lives. Yes. It was not a divorce on paper, right. but it was a divorce. So from the year 2016, which is seven years ago now, <laughs> yes. y'all have been apart. Yeah. Well, fans are just learning the news now. Jada confirms to today that she and Will have been apart since 2016 and explains the reason they kept things quiet. I guess my question is, I feel like you're a straight talker. I am except you're not sometimes yeah so why do that like what was the reason i think just not being ready yet mm. still trying to figure out between the two of us yeah how to be in partnership right and in regards to how do we present that to people you know and we hadn't figured that out Jada also shed some light on what led them to part ways. Why did the relationship fracture? Oh, well, why it fractured? That, that's a lot of things. Yeah. And I think by the time we got to 2016, we were just exhausted with trying. I think we were both kind of still stuck in our fantasy of what we thought the other person should be. And while Jada admits that she's considered divorce, she ultimately decided not to file the official legal paperwork. I made a promise that there will never be a reason for us to get a divorce. We will work through whatever. And I just haven't been able to break that promise. Mm. But you still live separately. We live separately. After mentioning that the two are working through their issues, Jada indicates that they are still navigating their relationship. The 52-year-old also tells People in a profile published on October 11th, quote, We're still figuring it out. We've been doing some really heavy-duty work together. We just got deep love for each other, and we are going to figure out what that looks like for us. Jada and Will had already been separated for six years the night of the 2022 Oscars, where he won the Best Actor trophy for his lead role in King Richard and slapped Chris Rock on stage after the comedian made a joke about Jada's shaved head. Jada tells People her reaction to the shocking moment, saying, quote, I thought, this is a skit. I was like, there's no way that Will hit him. It wasn't until Will started to walk back to his chair that I even realized it wasn't a skit. 
Jada and Will tied the knot in 1997 following his divorce from Cherie Zampino, with whom he shares 30-year-old son, Trey Smith. The couple, who share kids Jaden Smith and Willow Smith, have made headlines as they've gone through ups and downs in their relationship over the years, including what Jada called in 2020 her entanglement with August Alsina. Alright, man. Yeah. Man. You bitches, man. You bitches. You bitches ain't shit, man. You bitches ain't shit. This is the second time you embarrassed this man. Second time you humiliated him. Lord, you gonna, Lord, you gonna Lord. say? See, now that makes it look even worse that he slapped Chris Rock when he wasn't even with the bitch. He wasn't even with her. And you slapped him. Now, I, me personally, I always def I'm always i going to defend my wife. You ain't going to make no jokes about my wife. That's just the bottom line. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But mm -hmm. you humiliated this man two times. You are, you are a conniving bitch. Like, there's no way you're going to sit here and tell me that you're not. <laughs> You literally, literally humiliated this man twice. How you going? How you going to say that y'all separated for seven years? And you're telling, and you're you, you, you're talking to the tabloids. It ain't like it ain't like you know you're talking to a family member. So you want people to know this. What was the point of you doing that though? Why? Why is that? Why is this a story? If it was secret, then why not just keep it that way? But then you know why she don't want a divorce. Because she was the one that did him dirty. And I love how I love this, man. I love this. I love how they encapsulate this whole thing and make it seem like it's his fault that all this happened. It doesn't it to me, it doesn't make it seem it, it, it doesn't make any sense. How this person, I think that was Gail King, I believe that was Gail King, who's interviewing her. It was. Didn't call her out and say, well, you probably don't want to do that because you were the one that did him dirty. Never heard nothing about Will Smith. Not one thing. When you hear about Will Smith, you hear her name when they was in it. He married to mm -hmm. Jada. He built her up. He don't need her. She's nah, she's absolutely nothing without him. Nothing. I don't care what she did. Her her career is absolutely nothing compared to him. Mm -hmm. She could take little roles here and there. She could have been in on the shows here and there. Whatever. But it's nothing compared to him. He built her. He made her who she is today. You know what I'm saying? So for her to get on out here and and embarrass this man twice, and they're gonna say, Oh, I, I made a commitment. Yeah, because you know if you go file for a divorce, you're gonna be the one to have to pay him. Because you was the one that cheated. See how this works? Mm -hmm. This is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. These these bitches is wild. She's wild as fuck for that. How? How you say you love this man and you embarrassed him like that? There's no way in the world we would still be together. I would have divorced that stupid goofy bitch, that pretty pretty ass goofy bitch, fast as hell. I'd have been like, nah, you, uh. -uh. But Will, a stand-up man, that nigga can have any woman he wants on this planet. I ain't no homo, but that's a good-looking brother. He can have any woman on this planet. He's literally what women are looking for. I believe what 
Yeah. Hey Siri, how tall is Will Smith? Will Smith is six feet two inches. He's six two. Most women mm -hmm. with a man is six feet. He's still in shape. Mm-hmm. It's listen, man. I, I Jada, get your goofy ass the fuck out of here. That's all I gotta say, man. I'm done with her. I'm done with her. Man, I, I don't even know what to say at this point. Um, I really don't. To me personally, I feel like she's lying. Because there ain't no way, there ain't no way you couldn't have known that that wasn't no skit. There's no way you couldn't have known that wasn't no skit. The looks on your face. First of all, let me explain something to y'all about reactions, right? Sometimes your body reacts just off of instinct alone. Your brain don't even have to tell it to react. You can look at something and be disgusted, but your brain is telling you to react differently, like you're laughing or you're crying or whatever, but your body reacts differently. Her facial expressions tells it all when he slapped Chris Rock. You understand what I'm saying? Her facial expressions told it all before the slap even happened, and it told it all after the slap happened. She knew that wasn't no skit. Come mm -hmm. on, man. Are you serious? She knew it wasn't no skit. You already intended for that brother to go up there and do that. The whole look, your whole mystique said, go up there and defend my honor. That's exactly what it said. That's exactly what it said. It's either it said that or it said, yo, go up there and do whatever. But it definitely did not say, oh, that's a skit. No. Mm -hmm. your, your, your facial expression said something totally different. Your whole body language said something totally different. I hate when people do that. I really do. I hate when people say one thing, but their body language say something totally different. You know good and well, you know good and well that that's not what occurred. You know that. But then again, like I said, you know, um, always trying to paint the brother to be something that he not. Then again, they they always do that. They want to throw him under the bus. They want to mm -hmm. make him look like the villain when it's not even the case. Look, real, real people know that's not the case with Will Smith. Real people know. He made that mistake. He made that choice because of her. She has some sort of mental, mental stronghold on him. That's all I can say. She has some sort of stronghold on him, and she's clamping on it hard like you've had people <sighs> there were people out there that was reaching out to him this there this this uh there's like text messages on the internet of other artists celebrities reaching out to him and be, and asking him are you okay why are you letting this woman do this to you wasn't it 50 cent was it 50 cent that reached out to him and said Yo, bro, why are you letting her do that? Come on now. Are you serious? Look, y'all women got to stop doing that. Stop making the good brothers look like punks. Stop it. Because I promise you, if he was somebody different and he was over here yoking up females, throwing them against the wall, backhand slap, body slam, whatever. Mm -hmm. This type of stuff would have never came out to the public. Yeah. This would have never came out to the public. You would have seen Jada with all, with all types of glasses and makeups on and whatever. Oh, that never happened. No, oh, but, but clearly you would have seen, seen something different, but she would have been telling you something different. 
And then y'all would have ate that up and then went on about y'all business. Look, man, I ain't surprised. It is what it is, man. Y'all keep hey, doing y'all. Listen, man. You goofy bitches need to chill. Real. <laughs> All you goofy bitches need to chill. Respect your husband. <laughs> Sound like Barry oh, White. God. Respect your husband, baby. <laughs> goofy bitches respect your husband, baby. Oh, man. That's funny. Out of here. Sketch pass. See yeah.